we stand on is the territory of many nations, including the Mississaugas of the Credit, the Anishinaabek, the Chippewa, the Haudenosaunee, and the Wendat peoples, and is now home to many diverse First Nations, Inuit and Métis people. We also acknowledge that Toronto is covered by Treaty 13 with the Mississaugas of the Credit. Welcome to the 2021 awards presentation and the closing of the 21st Real World Film Festival. Since 2001, we continue to celebrate the stories of diverse Canadian filmmakers because we believe Canada has some of the best talent in the world, and these awards allow us to spotlight that talent. So thank you to all the filmmakers for the wonderful work you shared with us at the festival. Your expression of the world is what helps to shift, expand, and transform perspectives. I'd like to take a moment to thank all of our partners and funders, especially TD Bank Group and Telefilm Canada, who have been with us for decades. This year, Real World Film Festival is proud to award over $20,000 in cash and over $20,000 in prizes to the recipients of our festival awards this year. We'd like to thank TD Bank Group, Warner Media, DGC National, Shaftesbury, Bell Fund, CBC, CMPA, CMF, IPF, WIF Toronto, Entertainment Partners Canada, Chargefield, and Astro Lab Studios for their generous contributions towards these awards. We would also like to thank Pierre Laurent for gifting luxury watches to this, this year's six Trailblazers, our Visionary Award recipients, and our Award of Excellence recipient. We also want to mention how much we appreciate all the audience members who took the time to rate the films they watched and were vital to the selection of this year's Real World Audience Choice Award. A big thank you to our board of directors, our staff and volunteers who work so tirelessly through the year and to our audience members and community who continue to come out year after year to support diverse Canadian filmmaking and storytelling. Good luck to everyone tonight. Hi, my name is Sasha Lee Henry and I'm the chair of the Real World Screen Institute. This year we are presenting two significant awards, our Award of Excellence and our Visionary Award. The Award of Excellence honors Canadian industry leaders whose creative excellence over decades has positively impacted the representation of Canada's diversity nationally and internationally. The 2021 Award of Excellence goes to Mina Shum, who has written and directed award-winning films that have premiered at Sundance, Toronto, and Berlin. Her feature, Double Happiness, has won Best Canadian Feature at TIFF and Best First Feature at Berlin. And in 2021, Shum was nominated for a Canadian Screen Award for Best Direction in a Drama Series. Hello. I'm so honored and thrilled to be here. I'm so grateful to receive the Real World Award of Excellence 2021. Thank you. Know that I cannot receive this award alone. In my immigrant parents' understanding, an award of excellence is a top honor. And if you're giving it to their daughter, you're kind of giving the award to them too. So this is for my mother, 
So Yi Sheng, who enchanted me with classic bedtime stories when I was five and told these stories in Cantonese and broken English and with such joy and humor, it was infectious. This is also for my father, Yu Sheng, who had the courage to leave his home country to start a new life with babies in tow. Without all the hard, necessary stuff he taught me, without coming to this country, I'm not sure what would have become of me. And thank you. Thank you to this community. This community, all of you here, it's so wonderful to hold this space with you and share it to the audiences, supporters, and collaborators. I dedicate this to you for continuing to fight the good fight, huh? Right? That's what we're doing. And for showing up for yourself and each other. I share this, I share this with you with much gravity. Wow, congratulations, Mina. That was such a moving speech. I also would like to congratulate all the recipients. Hello, my name is Patricia Baby Amawa, and I am the chair of our charity arm, Real World Foundation. Now, a friendly reminder to please donate, you know, on our website and uh, make sure that you follow us on social media and keep in touch. Now, the Visionary Award honors individuals whose work, passion, and determination has made a significant contribution to Canadian film, television, and media. This year, our Visionary Award recipients are Amos Adetuyi of Blue Circle Productions, who is an award-winning producer with over 25 years of experience. Most notable television credits include the groundbreaking drama, Dickstown, which is on CBC and BET, currently in production in its third season, and director and producer Alphonse Adetui of Inner City Films, who has produced and directed over 100 hours of primetime features. Wow, documentaries, dramas, and lifestyle series. And he was named one of 2018's top 30 black directors by blackfilm.com. His Love Jack streams on Netflix worldwide. Congratulations to Alphonse, and Emos Adetui. Uh, I'm just so pleased to, to have this award, a, a, a visionary award. I never anticipated anything like that when I started uh, doing this uh, so many years ago. Uh, and so I'm very appreciative. Thank you, Tanya. Thank you so much to Real World uh, because it's, uh, it's what you do and, and what Real World does. It inspires us year after year to continue to to do the things that we do so so thank you so much for this uh and it's funny when you get and receive something like this an honor like this it takes you back into like so what what the heck were you doing to to, to, to be honored this way so i think it's just uh associating myself with a lot of great uh people who really know how to tell uh these diverse stories and they over the years kind of inspired me to to uh to just continue to to put forward these stories and and lo and behold uh, you know uh, many of them have come to fruition so and and, and uh i mean i think of, of myself as uh, well i'm a producer so i'm a salesman so that's what i do but the to have the uh the fortune the good fortune to to put together uh these stories from writers and the directors and the cast that I've worked with over the years uh, has been amazing. And uh, so thank you to all of them uh, to, to, to be able to share this award with them. And uh, just to reflect back on, on, a, on, on where it started, I, I'm gonna pull up this picture. There's, there's the gang, there's the whole family. And there's the uh, the brothers that started uh, this uh, whole career for me. Uh, Alphonse, thank you so much in saying, "Hey, come on down and and and, and do this with me." And uh, and of course, Rob and Tom, we've had a lot of fun working together. 
And uh, for all the people over the, through the years that I, I've worked with, and, and most lately, of course, uh, Floyd Kane, who I've worked with half my career, I can't believe it. We've been working together on so many things like Big's Town, which we created uh, for like 15 years we've been working together, and that's crazy. So it's been a lovely journey, and to, to have this uh, is uh, quite an honor, uh, unexpected. Uh, so, uh, since we're sharing this award, Alphonse, I think I'll just pass it on to you. So again, thank you all so much. Uh, it's quite an honor. I'm honored to receive this award. Thank you, Tanya, uh, and the real world, uh, the entire real world team, the board. Um, I just want to say there have been many positive changes over the last uh, few years in regard to diversity in the Canadian film and television industry. And I share this award with those people in government and the funding agencies, yeah, at the broadcasters and uh, the individuals and diverse companies that have been pushing for more representation over the years. Um, I would especially like to thank uh, my brother Amos, who's been a partner for quite a while. He was a partner pushing you know, our diverse stories for many years. Uh, uh, I want to thank the entire Attitude team. He showed you some pictures. That was Tom and Rob and Veronica, Joey, Matthew, and Daniel. That's the Attitude team. I'd also like to thank um, Ora, uh, Orla Guerreras, Sydney Chu, and four women who uh, have been a great support to me over the years uh, Marva Olivier, uh, Cora Tono, and my editor and creator and life partner for over 30 years, Lisa D. Michele. And uh, of course, I'd like to thank my mom. So thanks again. This is a wonderful award. Thanks, appreciate it. And now I'm honored to introduce this year's six trailblazers, remarkable individuals who inspire others and blaze a trail of excellence through their constant efforts to improve and diversify our vibrant film and television industry. Filmmaker and director, Alicia K. Harris, screenwriter, comedian, and creator, Amber Sokoan Daniels, artist, Carson Ting, filmmaker, producer, director, and actor, Elmaya Tailfeathers, visual artist and illustrator, Gaima Gariba, and producer and consultant, Shivani Saini. Congratulations. Hi, my name is Alicia K. Harris, and I am a writer and director from Scarborough, Ontario. Thank you so much to Real World Film Festival for honoring me with this Trailblazer Award. It truly means a lot to me. Um, you know, being in this industry can be very isolating at times, being a black person. Um, there's many times where I'm the only black person or a black woman or a person of color in the room. And honestly, receiving this award is just a reminder that there is such a strong community behind me and especially from a festival like Real World that does so much to support the local BIPOC community and foster and nurture our talent. So um, thank you for reminding me that I am supported and my work is recognized and loved. And I hope you all enjoy the festival. Hi, everyone. Thank you for having me. My name is Carson Ting. I'm an illustrator and artist out here in Vancouver. Uh, I am extremely grateful for the Real World's 2021 Trailblazer Award. I am deeply honored and humbled to be selected as, as a recipient. Um, this is, has become such a great motivation for me to keep doing what I'm doing. For the, especially for the past two years, uh, the world has been quite crazy and nutty. Um, so it's really important than ever, uh, you know, to have this diversity. Uh, to be in this field uh, for folks of color background and to have opinions in this world of media arts and film you know representation matters big or small I've, every bit counts um, and as a middle-aged asian man being able to contribute to society uh, with my art means the world to me and uh, i hope real world will continue to help inspire many future artists filmmakers and more for many generations to come it is truly refreshing and cool to see you know so much progress we have made, especially just through real world's platform and initiatives. It's, um, you know, very, very inspiring to see so many great artists here doing big things, making an impact while representing so many diverse groups. Thank you for this award. And I'm very proud to be able to tell my mom that I didn't end up being a starving artist. Thank you all. 
Oki Boris, um Elamaya Abinaskim Tail Feathers. Hi, I'm Elamaya Abinaskim Tail Feathers. Um, I'm a filmmaker and an actor from uh, the Kainai First Nation and also Sami from Norway. Um, I want to thank everyone at Real World for this incredible honor. Um, I'm I'm yeah, just just so touched to be um, to be named one of the Trailblazers this year. Uh, it's it's incredible to be in such beautiful company. Um, and I, I just want to thank everyone for the important work uh, that they're doing in this industry. Uh, as Alicia said, it can be really lonely and isolating and challenging to be uh, to be a person of color and indigenous person in this industry. Um, and it's so meaningful to have community and to have support and to and to celebrate each other's achievements um, and and all of the important work that's happening in the industry because we are seeing change. Um, and I just wanted to dedicate the award to my grandparents, Utguitta and Abiniskim Tail Feathers, who are both residential school survivors and built a beautiful legacy of, of love through family and community and culture. And I am what I am because of everything that they, that they did for me and my family. Um, and so they are trailblazers to me. And so I wanted to dedicate the award to them um, and thank them for all of their important work. Um, yeah, I think that's all I have to say. Thank you. Hi, everyone. My name is Jima Gariba. Um, I'd first like to thank Real Word for this incredible honor. Um, I'm in such good company. Um, like everyone else has said before, uh, working in this medium is isolating and it takes a lot of time. So I spend a lot of time hunched over my desk. So uh, turning around to find that not only just a community of filmmakers and artists that are busy toiling away in their own corners, but to turn around and be celebrated by that same community really feels incredible and beyond words. Like it truly is the definition of feeling seen. So I feel very honored to be holding this space with all of you right now. And um, in the medium that I work in in animation, it's such a big medium. So I'd like to dedicate this award to everyone around me, family members and coworkers and friends who have helped uphold me through this time and helped make me feel as though um, telling the story I had to tell was an important thing to do during this time. And uh, more specifically, I'd like to dedicate this award to my late father, Sule Gariba, who uh, passed on earlier this year and who I think is shining on me every day. So thank you. Hi, everyone. My name is Shivani Sani. I'm a producer and a consultant, and I've worked in the business for over 25 years. I am deeply humbled by this and honored to accept a 2021 Real World Trailblazer Award. Uh, personally, the timing of this has been so empowering to me. Uh, I'm grateful uh, for this recognition and for being seen by an organization I have such uh, incredible respect for and that continues to do fantastic work for racialized film and TV creatives uh, throughout our country. It's also really wonderful to be in the company of such incredible talent and a heartfelt congratulations to everyone else. I'd like to thank my mom and my brothers who have always been there for me and all of the incredible uh, peers, friends and colleagues that I have throughout Canada. Um, you know, if I ever question, if I ever question what I'm doing or why, I now have a really beautiful memento to remind me. So thank you very much, Danyavad, namaste. We'll be announcing the awards for a number of categories for the films presented at Real World this year. Thank you to our jurors, owner, president, and producer of Eagle Vision Inc., Lisa Meaches, director of content for BGMI Inc., Andrea Griffith, film score and composer, Medhat Hanbali, CSA nominated actor, Connie Wang, owner of Karma Films Inc., Anad Ramea, executive producer Richard Jean-Baptiste and director of industry for DG60 Film Festival, Mesa Puri. Our awards this year includes outstanding film, standout producer, director, writer, actor, and actress for both features and short films, and of course, our Audience Choice Award. And this year we want to do something special for our filmmakers. As our awards presentation is on a digital platform, 
we invited some of Canada's biggest and brightest stars to present their awards. So let's get started. Hi there. And I'm coming to you from the unceded and traditional territories of the Musqueam, Sabretooth, and Squamish nations. I'm Angela Moore, and I play Darlene Fowler from Nancy Drew. I am pleased to announce that the standout actress in a feature film winning $1,500 in cash goes to Aki Yagubi for Sinla Havana. Congratulations. Yay! Okay. <laughs> Give me a moment. <laughs> I I think um I think our primary need as human is connection and and the stories magically satisfy that need. And um, I'd like to take this opportunity to celebrate storytellers, storytellers who stick with their authentic voice and tell a story to connect us. I appreciate everyone in the industry who is putting effort to make the workplace a safe and respectful place for everyone. And I think these efforts are not being acknowledged enough and they are the ones that should be awarded too. Um, it's celebration time, so I like to celebrate our society. I think we are learning from our mistakes and moving in the right direction. I'd like to applaud every single door that is open to diverse members of our society. I'd like to thank cast and crew of Sin La Habana. I learned a lot from all of you. And thank you, Real World. I'm touched, obviously, by this award and <clears throat> recognition. My dear Iran, Iran Azizam, برای تو روزهای بهتر آرزو می کنم. My beautiful Montreal, je t'aime. Tu me manques beaucoup. And Cuba, te deseo mejores días. Thank you. Hi there, my name is Mei Kung Wing and I play Sarah Jung on Hudson Rex. I am pleased to announce that the standout cinematographer for a short film, including $1,000 cash, uh, goes to Bongani Malambo for Stray. Congratulations, Bongani. Hi, I'm Wen Jiren Jendu, the director of Stray. Um, Bongani is not here to receive the award, he's on set, but um, I'm gonna try to speak as him. Thank you so much, the Real World Awards, um, for recognizing Stray and for recognizing his work on the film. Um, thank you to our producer who made every coin count and made the film look as amazing as possible. Um, Bongani would like to thank his family who are his rock and uh, just every support in his system with the creative endeavors that he does. And as a director, I would like to thank Bongani. He took a film that could have been uh, one way and elevated it above and beyond and made every frame count with just the beauty and color in spite of the horror of the film and the, the situation of the film. Um, thank you for lighting two dark-skinned actresses, incredibly beautiful, uh, making the Afros look very fierce on camera. And above all, he thanks everybody on, he thanks his, his camera crew, his grip and electric and everybody who did their best to ensure that this was a, a safe production for both the cast and the crew and for a young actress. Um, and thank you very much to 20th Digital Studios that picked up the film. Thank you. Hi, my name is Cortian Moore and I play Jaden on Slash of Flesh and Blood. And I'm very pleased to announce that the standout director for a feature film award, winning $1,500 cash, goes to Cave the Bastion for Sin La Habana. Oh, wow. Uh, okay. That's nice. Thank you. 
I didn't actually expect that. That's so I didn't uh, prepare anything in particular, but uh, this has been such a long journey and uh, this is a huge, a huge honor. Um, I was at the very first real world film festival, I think, or maybe the second, and I, I won an award then and I haven't been back in, uh, yeah, 20, 21 years. So it's, uh, it feels like I'm coming kind of full circle, but um, more importantly, I just want to thank the festival for the important work that you guys are doing and um, and everybody who was involved in this film, it's been going, I mean, I started working on this uh, in 2005 with Pablo, who's also, who's also here. And uh, so big up to Pablo, big up to Aki, who just won an award. That's awesome for you, Aki. And, uh, and everybody who, who joined me on this, this incredibly, incredible and long journey. So thank you very much. Dance everybody. My name is Crystal Lightning. I'm from the Muskekasik Enoch Cree Nation here in Treaty 6. I currently play Michelle Knockwood on Digstown. And I am pleased to announce the standout actor for a short film award, winning $1,000 cash, goes to Kingston Gomes of Baba. Congratulations. Thank you so much. I am. I'm so blown away. I want to thank everybody that was a part of this film. And thank you everyone for being here. And yeah, that was. Are you, are you in shock? <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Okay, here. We'll thank you. So see, how about, oh. do, you want to, do you want to thank anyone in particular? Um, I want to thank Jay and Javier and Panta for trusting me in like sharing this powerful story and yeah I'm just in shock right now so <laughs> thank you thank you so much congratulations uh hi everyone my name is Alexander Nunez and I play Sammy Finley Cullen on Moonshine I am pleased to announce that the standout writer for a feature film award winning fifteen hundred dollars cash goes to Kave Nabatian and Pablo Di Herrera Vetia for Sin La Habana. Congratulations. Wow. Um, well, yeah, I'm so pleased to share this award with Pablo because Pablo and I spent uh, many, many years Skyping. He was in uh, mostly in Scotland and sometimes in Cuba, and we went back and forth a lot. So, so I'm really glad that, uh, that Pablo's work is being being highlighted and uh, and yeah, and I forgot the last one to say also, thank you so much for the, um, putting Sin La Habana as the opening night gala, real world, you guys are you guys are awesome. But Pablo, do you wanna say something? Yeah, um, thank you so much. This is really unexpected. Um, I, first, and, first and foremost, I would like to thank um, my my mother who was basically the, the witness to the work that we're doing today. And she's passed already, but uh, definitely she is looking at us and shining a light on, the, on this project. I also would like to thank Kave for his really, really hard work and his patience with this project. that has been in the making for, as you know, since 20, 2005. And basically to the cast and crew of Sin Lavana, people like that came in and out, people like Vanessa Batista and people who helped get this, get, get, get this project out and, um, and running. And obviously to Kave for basically making this project, the film that, that you see today. I'm really, really happy for this. Thank you to Aki. Thank you to the, 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 um, the actors from Cuba as well, um, who did a fantastic job. And this is, this is, this is amazing. So thank you for this uh, real world. I just don't know why else to say, so thank you so much for this. This is an incredible um, acknowledgement I have. I was not expecting any of this. Thank you. Hi there, uh, my name is Aaron Kazam and I play Ross Kaligi on CBC's Coroner. And I am very pleased to announce that the standout actress in a short film winning $1,000 cash goes to Trinity Mariah Jones for Stray. Congratulations. Oh, <laughs> um, thank you. Um, okay, so first off, I want to thank the director, Ms. Wanjiru, and the writer, Ms. Perez, 
who also played my mom in the film. I want to thank them and the rest of the cast. I had an amazing time filming Stray. Amazing. Um, thank you for giving me this award. And I also want to dedicate this to my mom, and my dad, basically my entire family. And yeah, I'm shocked. <laughs> thank you. Hi, uh, my name is Tina Jang and I play Joy on CBC Strays. And I am pleased to announce that the standout cinematographer for feature film winning $1,500 cash goes to Juan Pablo Ramirez Zabanez for Sin La Habana. Congratulations. <laughs> I guess Juan Pablo's not here. Well, Juan Pablo, man, big up. Juan Pablo and I worked really, really hard on the images. Um, and Juan Pablo is just an amazing DP and his career is just going like that. And I don't know if I'll be able to afford him the next time around. So I'm glad I got the opportunity to, to work with him. And, um, and I'm sure he would want to thank Daniel durand -Lo and everybody in the camera crew because they were awesome and they put up with uh, our kind of unusual style of shooting. So, uh, so thanks Juan Pablo and I'm so happy for you. Hey, my name's Kevin Hanchard and I play Superintendent Joe Donovan on Hudson and Rex. I'm honored to be here tonight to present the award for Outstanding Producer Short Film, which carries a prize of $1,000 cash. Oof. So without further ado, I'm pleased to announce that the winner of this award tonight is John Tan and Ivan D. Osa for In Other News. Congratulations. I don't even know what to say. <laughs> I don't know if John is here, but uh, thank you, Real World, for uh, this amazing opportunity um, to showcase, you know, our talent and everything. It's always a blessing whenever uh, you get recognized for work that you put in, you know. So I want to thank you guys for everything that you guys do and uh, for blessing us with this with this gift. You know, it was, it was thank you, thank you for real. Um, I don't know if John is here, but he's. I'm going to say thank you for him um, to all the crew cast family members, and everyone that was on that side. God bless. Thank you, guys. Hi, everybody. My name is Kevin Vidal. I play Liam on CBC Strays, and I am pleased to announce that the standout actor in a feature film award winning $1,500 cash goes to Yona Costa-Gonzalez for Sin La Habana. Congratulations. Wow. Um, yeah, I don't know what Yona would say, but Yona is, you, when Yona started on this film, he had never acted, I mean, he's an, but he's a professional ballet dancer, so I knew he would be a, a good actor, but it took him a, it took him a minute to figure out the, how to move with a camera and everything and how to, you know, how to act. And, uh, so I'm, I'm so happy for him that his, his talent, which by the end of the film, I thought he was a fantastic actor, and I'm, and I'm so happy for him that his talent is being recognized. And uh, I, I'm sure he's going to have a great career as an actor as well as a ballet dancer. And I, and I recommend everyone check out Yona Alcosta's incredible dancing on YouTube or when, he, when the Munich Ballet comes to your town. So thank you again, because it's getting crazy. Uh, hello, my name is Andrew Moody. I play Principal Lounsbury on Detention Adventure. I am pleased to announce that the standout writer for short film award winning $1,000 cash goes to Jay Kamal and Javier Badillo for Baba. Uh, <laughs> this is such an honor. Um, thank you so much to all the staff at Real World for putting it on such a wonderful festival. I'm so grateful um, to be in this festival this year. Uh, it was a wonderful experience. Um, huge thanks to the amazing cast and crew and to my co-writer and producer Javier and my producer Panta, who's here as well. Um, thank you for believing in this film. Thanks to Crazy Eights for selecting the project and supporting us all the way. I'm so humbled to be in the presence of all you incredibly talented artists and to share this stage with you. Thank you for telling uh, diverse stories and pushing our industry and our art forward. And huge congrats to uh, Kingston Gomez, who just won uh, Best Actor. It's his first film, and he was such a pleasure to work with. And I'm so excited to see uh, the future he has in front of him. Thank you. Absolutely. I, I, 
I couldn't have said it better. Thanks, Jay. What he said. <laughs> this was awesome. Thank you very, very much. This is, yeah, speechless. I'm happy that Jay uh, had uh, had uh, had better uh, <laughs> had better thinking on his feet on, on his feet. Um, but uh, we appreciate this very much. Thank you very much. Hi, my name is Rachel Crawford, and I play Grace Galloway on Slasher, Flesh and Blood. And I am pleased to announce that the standout feature film producer award winning $1,500 cash goes to Brishke Ahmed for In the Rumbling Belly of the Motherland. Hi. Uh, I'm uh, Fatima Tawakuli, but uh, uh, thank you so much uh, to uh, committee and uh, the organizers of the program for the Choose Me. But uh, 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 I want to uh, thank you for Bershkai Ahmad for giving me the opportunity to work with them and uh, uh, also for uh, work uh, from dear schools and expensive expense. And uh, then I would like to uh, take this opportunity so uh, the, that we are the some girls and boys of the opportunity, but we will un, uh, unleash our uh, latent uh, talent, but now that the time is not right for you or for you, uh, any Afghan girls and the situation is getting worse every day. But uh, I want to um, express my uh, concern that the fate of the girls in my country um, is unknown and that we must support, but uh, that uh, them so that they can get the right to education and work again and like women able to make um, decisions about their future, we must not leave Afghanistan alone, it's, it's especially women for girls. Thank you so much. Hi, everyone. My name is Karen LeBlanc, and I play Ellen Hunter on Departure. I am pleased to announce that the standout director for a short film award winning $1,000 cash goes to King Louis Palamo for Nene. Congratulations. Um, hi, <laughs> I'm just like working here as well, but <laughs> um, thank you so much. I wasn't really expecting it. Um, uh, to be honest, this this film is dedicated to my grand aunt and my, my dad. Um, um, who inspired the film to make the film and uh, you know it's uh, yeah it's it's their story that I just want to share with everyone this is my first directorial film and I'm honored to to get this award um, and yeah and um, like as I make the film and finish the film after three years um, and during the pandemic I just realized that the, the meaning of the story when I'm sharing it is now to um, to check in with with your with your loved ones, check with your friends, check with your families, and just say hi and just check how they're doing, because you never know um, that you know it it might be the last time. Hopefully not, but um, you know in this in this world right now we're in. But yeah, just check in, say hi. Um, saying hi to someone is really important. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for this award. I wasn't really expecting it. Um, yeah, I have. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hi there. I'm Dion Johnstone and I play Jordan Cole on Departure and Eric Whitley on Sweet Magnolias. And I'm pleased to announce that the Outstanding Short Film Award winning 1500 in cash goes to Baba. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. Oh. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> uh, wow. Okay, I've I've already said my piece. Uh, thank you so much. I'm gonna let Panta take this. Yes. Oh my gosh. Um, 
Javier, Jay, we did it, guys. <laughs> um, thank you so much for uh, bringing me on board to produce this beautiful story. And um, uh, Kingston just nailed it. The actors, Helen Elber is amazing in it. All of our actors and, and cast and crew were really wonderful. Um, you know, it, the, it was supposed to be pouring rain and, and um, you know, the weather just worked with us. Just when we were doing the exterior scenes, the rain just stopped. So all the pieces just fell into place and, you know, knock on wood, uh, wherever the wood is, um, everything just worked out and uh, teamwork, dream team. I'm not good at speeches. <laughs> <laughs> Give it to Jay. <laughs> awesome, thank, thank you. you so much, everybody. This is such an incredible honor. Thank you. Congratulations. Hello everyone, my name is Joel Lett and I played Jared on Trickster and Jeremy on Two Sentence Horror Stories. I'm pleased to announce the Outstanding Feature Film Award, winning $2,500 in cash, which goes to In the Rumbling Belly of the Motherland. Uh, thank you. Uh, Ali, uh, half misery, uh, two gap was that? No, Mushkilness. Hello to everyone. I just wanted to congratulate uh, Bershke Ahmed for uh, her film and winning this award and also producer award. Uh, we had not had a chance to watch the film yet. <laughs> I guess uh, since the film uh, won the awards, I guess it uh, came out pretty good. So like Fadima said uh, before, I wanted to use this opportunity besides congratulating the um, director and producer Bishke Ahmed. And I just uh, uh, enjoyed um, seeing too many artists in Canada, you know, with different skin colors, working together, making awesome things. But, uh, you know, I wanted to speak a little bit about my country and my country had no industry, no filmmaking, just uh, filmmakers who wanted to do something, but it's destroyed after 20 years of some hope that we had, but everything is destroyed. And the filmmakers, boys, girls, and journalists, artists. Now, I personally see no future for myself. So um, now in immigration camp in Germany, and uh, I guess I, I was kind of lucky to get out of uh, Afghanistan or not. Uh, I'm deeply sorry for what, what's happening in my country right now. And uh, yeah, <laughs> and I see you are in your comfort of your home or maybe your office right now, but I'm just like an immigrant uh, living in a camp. And <laughs> Uh, using this kind of uh, Wi-Fi internet, who I'm just afraid of uh, disconnecting any time. And yeah, I guess I speak a lot, and I hope that our country uh, some see some hope uh, another time, you know, one day. But I don't think so right now. And I wanted to ask all the Canadian Canadian brothers and sisters who is uh, who are working in this industry as artists uh, do something to maybe uh, those artists who could not get out of the country find a new home for themselves maybe Canada as we see people uh, you know and try their luck there or maybe become part of your community there. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for selecting this film. Uh, Real World, Ali's out. Thank you. Hello. Hi, everyone. It is great to see you. I am Samora Smallwood. 
I play Maddie Brewer on the upcoming Warner Brothers and Oprah Winfrey Network production, The Kings of Napa. And I am very pleased to announce the Audience Choice Award tonight, winning $2,000 in cash goes to With Wonder. Congratulations. Wow! What the? Byron, are you there? This is- I am. First of all, Samara, thank you for presenting that. Tanya, thank you because you've been there since day one, girl, from back in the day. You were fighting the good fight before it was a hashtag. So props to you <laughs> and props to Real World. Um, this is fantastic. Okay, Byron, say something. Byron Wong, the other producer. Oh. Hi, everyone. This is amazing. Um, we're just still on set. So this is, we're just shutting down and uh, it was so incredible to hear and see everyone tonight and 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 to have this uh at the very end of our night what an incredible thing um just want to say how grateful we are first of all to our, all of our participants and the people who are willing to share stories with us and of course to our incredible team sharon first of all congratulations to you and to kate and to justin and dominique and every, you know everyone elise everyone thank you so much and those participants who risk their lives to speak up, thank you, thank you, thank you for sharing your stories. Thank you, real world. Wow. Thank you. Yeah. Aww. This is amazing. Congratulations to all our outstanding award recipients and nominees. Real World is proud to support the development of Black, Indigenous, Asian, South Asian, and people of color in the Canadian screen industries by providing professional development and advocating for racial equity in Canadian content and production. You can find and connect with our presenters, award recipients, and talent on accessrealworld.ca, Canada's leading hiring platform for racialized crews and talent. So be sure to sign up because together we can transform the Canadian screen industry to be more inclusive. See you all next year.